after making strong alliances at the Villains Tribe. The heroes voted him out and we didn't, so he should stay. Jerry made the shock decision to return to the heroes. <laughs> Rattling. And in the immunity challenge, the heroes quickly overpowered the villains. <laughs> At camp. Myself, you, Geordie, and Fraser. Simon had the numbers to take down George. Operation Anaconda. <laughs> you like that? But when Geordie made the ultimate betrayal... I'm Simon's best mate in here. It's not what we do. Three times. Oh, my God. Simon was doomed. This will be the death of Simon and the second coming of King George. But at Tribal Council... The plan is to strengthen this tribe by chopping off the weak. You can't vote for yourself, mate. A surprise fire challenge. Simon wins. Individual immunity. Sent George into overdrive. I will cause a war between the three boys. Exposing Geordie's betrayal. Geordie's told every single person here about your ridal. I had to make a call, man. I'm so sorry. And giving Simon an ultimatum. Play your idol or you are finished. You're a dead duck unless you save Steve. That would end his alliance with Stevie. Steve, I'm so sorry. I'm flabbergasted. I'm shocked. <sighs> Leaving Fraser... Whoa! ...caught in the crossfire. So amazed with you, George. Thank you, Steve. 17 are left. Who will be going home tonight? I want to say I'm so forever grateful to both of you. You literally, with George, saved my survival. We did. Life, you did. Because we want you here. I know. We did what we did yesterday to save you, and yeah, now we're yeah, all yeah. here. And that's I'm all that matters. I'm now with you guys. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely. I know. That's good. Oh, Steve, you're welcome. Oh. You're a good guy, Stevie. Yeah. It's a very so tough game. It's the survivor. Yeah. I've never expected it to be like this. <laughs> Stevie, darling. Thank you, girl. Thank you. It's all right. You know we're here for you. Yeah. This morning, there's an eerie vibe in camp. You know, everyone's a little bit rattled. There's an elephant in the room, and no one knows how to talk about it. All right, mate. Yeah. A bit tired. Last night, George ousted me as a trader when he could have just stuck with me and used me. The idea was to blindside Simon, send him packing with his idol, just like last time. Would have been fantastic. Geordie, we're going to chat. Everything was taken away from me last night. Yep. My plan and the opportunity that we had together that we spoke about that I thought you were on board with, and you wanted to get rid of him? <sighs> Dude, they've been whispering about you for days. I man. know they've been whispering about me for days. Yeah, but what was I supposed to do, man? It was either go with you and go down with you, 
I was trying to stick with the majority. And, and how did that work out for you? Yeah, not well. So right now, I'm in a tricky situation. Last Night's Tribal has created a lot of challenges for my game moving forward. With George and Simon both ditching me, it's hard. I don't know where to go. It was less than a year ago, though, that I was sitting on a different beach in Survivor. Last time, I battled from the bottom. You know, I was three days off that half a million dollars. But last time was different. I was a single guy with not a care in the world. In fact, my life at home was terrible. I'd just lost my stepmum before coming into the game. I didn't want to be at home. I didn't want to be there. Now, <laughs> a year down the track, I've got everything I've ever wanted. Sam, she's amazing. Incredible human being. We got engaged not long ago. And just before leaving, I found out she's pregnant. So this time, my motivation's different. <laughs> It's, it's tough, you know, like, I've given up an important portion of my life to be here. When I could be at home, you know, with my pregnant fiance, like, enjoying life, you know, enjoying this adventure together. So I want to make sure that I leave nothing on the table. The tribe's a mess. It's chaos. It's everyone's gone mad. As we all know, the Joker thrives in chaos. You cannot control your outcome in this game. There is only so much you can control. Just keep going day by day. And that's how I will survive. My hair feels so dirty. <laughs> Oh, is that nice? I feel like I'm getting baptized. <laughs> Shorty! I want my nose! <laughs> Sorry. It's refreshing out. Yeah. He's rattled me. Oh. That was rough, at. I sure know. Yeah. Jordy is definitely taking this hard, but I don't really blame him. George completely threw Geordie under the bus. Like I told him that Simon had the idol, like yeah. everything. And Shawnee and I How have said he is trusted? good for it. Liz and I want to protect Geordie because I actually trust Geordie out here. So dirty, it's like <laughs> cold. And he's someone that I see myself working with long term. <laughs> I need oh, that. This is good. Oi, here's what I reckon, right? Whatever happens, us three, I know, can have fun. Yeah, absolutely. Genuine fun. Yeah. I just hope we can all move forward, forget about the egos, and just concentrate on what we're here to do. Oh, this actually feels quite solid. Oh. Coordination. I mean, what more could a girl ask for? <sighs> piece of wood I've ever picked up. Oh. This is not my first rodeo having an idol. And it's come at the perfect time because we are at a stage in the game where there is so much uncertainty. This is a huge turning point. This idol is a way to look out for my best friends. Good girl, what a good find, what a good day. A beautiful day. Go ahead, Lee! Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
Returning back to the hero's tribe, I'm an outsider. <laughs> On the villain tribe, they accepted me. I could have stayed there, worked with George. I thought, no, I don't leave my mates behind. I came back to the hero's tribe for Shani. Shani will take a bullet for me. And I'll do the same for her. <laughs> Coming back, it just makes sense to make sure that everybody feels that I am hero strong at this point. <laughs> Mission successful. Um, you have this one person, mate, that could work their way in, just charm everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Um. How are you feeling, Joe, coming back? Are you hero strong or, like, are you... Still once a hero, always yeah. a hero. Am I back here? Yeah, like, for yeah, good? Like, you're not going to side with them? But if we go to a swap, you bloody turn on me, I'll turn on you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, OK. No? You want to be a snake? I'll bloody bite your back. <laughs> what did you think what the dynamics think? were of the tribe? They're nice, you know, and, yeah. they, they, yeah. and, they, and, and they, they sort of, like, hung on to me yeah. as if I was the Holy Grail. They made me feel welcome, they loved me. Yeah. Hey, they didn't vote against me, not like you bastards. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Two nights in a row. <laughs> yeah. They threw me to the wolves my beloved heroes. Jerry, the reason why we, yeah. we voted you, it wasn't like, we're going to send Jerry home. That was not the yeah. intention no, 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 at I, all. I, I know that. But, but, it, but it does show me exactly where I am in this food chain, and that's right on the box. Well, because you had a really it bad was, injury, you Jerry. Know, it was really yeah. Yeah. Oh, No, no, but the, the, the next vote, my injury was, was better. And still, when we were collectively try, trying to decide who was going to, to go next door, Sam said, no, we need to send somebody over that we don't need, that we can do without. Or, Put yourself in my shoes. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Hey, Jerry, um, you know, full transparency, I've discerned that you voted for me that evening. Well, I, I thought that you would be a better ambassador than I. <laughs> really? I appreciate look, look, that. Look, at, look at your silver tongue. What did they want to know about us? Um, nothing really, because they knew everything, you yeah? know? Well, they know that these three boys are the hierarchy. <laughs> then you got Maddie, the apprentice. Then you got you two girls around there, and then everybody else is still being down there at the bottom. Down here, like, you run out of people to vote off. I'm not pulling any punches. They're not honest. They don't care about me. So the hero strong thing, well, that can just slide a little bit. I'm actually Jerry Strong. Jerry comes first now. When Jerry points out there's a hierarchy to the group, everyone feels uncomfortable because I think everyone secretly agrees. He's really taking a spill for me about what he thinks is going on over here. And... I mean, I, I, I was like, oh, I've got two new things. I'm like, one of them at the bottom and two of the silver top. I'm like, thanks, Jerry. I've got... <laughs> I'm either at the bottom of the hierarchy or very, very close. And I do not want to be where I am at the moment. Yeah, nice yeah, yeah, yeah. It feels like there's more beans. It feels like there's more rice.
unbox some of that down in it? There are, you know, I got it. There's this. And I don't know what I've just found. Like, is this, is this a get an immunity idol? Is this a clue? I've watched quite a bit of Survivor and I haven't, to my knowledge, seen anything quite like this. I know that it's not an immunity idol. It comes with no instructions confirming that it is. I don't know I've got a clue, but I don't have the corresponding pieces to make sense of what this means. From the outside looking in, the heroes are a very cohesive tribe. <laughs> I'm on your team. I have your back. But I think that's a fairy tale. And I've not been a kid for a really long time. If this clue leads me to an idol that I desperately need right now, it could be a game changer. Getting your first look at the new villains tribe. Yeah. Oh. Fraser voted out in the last tribal council. Oh, wow. Simon, that was a pretty intense tribal last night. What happened over there? Oh, look, I could tell you that there was a unanimous vote and Fraser went home. Or I could tell you that George was swinging an idol around his head yelling, I'm the king of Survivor. And next minute, Fraser was collateral damage. But you guys can make up what you want to uh, <laughs> make of it. Interesting. That's, that's one interpretation. The other one was Geordie organised the blind side of Simon for the second time with an idol. He was so oblivious, he had no idea it was coming. But then we had an individual immunity challenge that Simon crushed and he saved himself. And sadly for Fraser, he was collateral damage in a minority vote. And I played my idol. What? Ta -da. Oh, that's a saga. Simon still has an idol. Thank you. Thank you, George. Yes. Yes, I do still have an idol. All right, you all ready to get to today's immunity challenge? Yes. All right, who has it? Yeah. Yep. There you go, nice. Thank you. Once again, immunity is back up for grabs. For today's challenge, in pairs, you are going to hold up a wooden block using only your feet. If at any point the block slips, hits the deck, you're out of the challenge. Last pair standing wins immunity for their tribe. Loses tribal council where somebody's going to become the seventh person voted out. Heroes, if you have five extra players, you're gonna need to sit out three women, two men, cannot be the same people in back-to-back -back challenges. Who's it gonna be? <laughs> Nina, Haley, Flick, Matthew, Sean. You're all on the bench. Everyone else, a minute to talk about it. Let's get to it. All right, here we go. Everyone's in position for immunity. This challenge is now on. Conscious end, mate. 
for the heroes. We have David with Sam, Paige with Shani, Ben with Jerry. For the villains, we have Simon with Geordie, George with Stevie, and Shani with Liz. I'm sure the villains would love to win this one and avoid another scrappy tribal council. I want to go back to tribal council. Breathe through it. Deep breaths, Jerry. Jerry, not happy. I'm going to go. Hmm? I'm going to go. You're going to... Oh, well done, Jerry. Well done. Well done. Jerry and Ben drop their block. Out of the challenge. Good effort, Jerry. Yeah. The heroes are down to two. Oh, <sighs> Simon's starting to shake. You all right there, fella? Oh, yep. Meanwhile, down the end here, Johnny and Liz locked and loaded, looking very strong in this challenge. Shawnee's in the zone over there. She is in the zone. Oh. Oh, oh. oh dear. Simon almost in tears on this one. Oh. Mate, if you want to go, we can just go. I'm OK, I'm OK. Don't hurt yourself, mate. These guys have got it. Oh, careful, bud. OK, they're actually... Well, Simon and Jordy drop their out. You gave it everything, mate. Bad luck, fella. You got him, guys. Villains down to two now. Heroes down to two. David and Sam continue to struggle. It's too hard, George. This is sore on my knee, Steve. It's too hard. George and Stevie struggling now. Bring it up. I don't want to have a drop. Not too much. God. Ah, oh, George, no, no, George, no, no, George. Up, 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 three. Ah. That is it. They are out. Take a spot on the bench. Oh, it's all up to Shawnee and Liz now. Paige with Shawnee. David with Sam. Still in it for the heroes. Come back into me, come back into me. Sam really struggling down the end there for the heroes. Quite the hurt now, man. Hey, 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 look, look. You got this, guys. Drop it, boys. Drop it. Go push in, bro. Push in. Bag him. And that is it. Man. After almost 30 minutes, David and Sam drop out. Now we have a showdown. Paige and Shawnee taking on Shawnee and Liz. Last pair standing. Wins immunity for their tribe. That's all it takes. All right. We are at 60 minutes. Yeah. 60 minutes. Well done. Nice work. Shawnee in the zone. Shawnee, you've had a crack at this challenge before. Mm-hmm. You remember how long you went? Um, two hours and five minutes. You think you got another two hours in you? Yep. Oh. Nah, hold on, girl. Nah, hold on. You've got plenty of dead meat to cut off at the heroes. It's okay. I'm with you. Whatever.
see you at Tribal Council, where one of you will become the seventh person voted out of Heroes versus Villains. Head on out. I will see you tonight. See you tonight, mate. Right. Jonathan. Do it. You just go, I'll just, I'll catch up. You good? That was so inspiring, mate. You did so well. Shani dropped it. Hey? Shani dropped it. I was gonna hold on. She dropped it. everyone that competed in that. That was so hard and amazing to watch you all and really proud of both Paige and Shani yeah. for that. Incredible. It was incredible. Proud you guys did amazing. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, when you're pushing through pain like that, it's all mental. Yeah. It really comes down to all mental. Um, yeah. 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 Fire, Let's yeah. do it. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, do, I'll watch the yeah, right. you, you can get that on if you get that on. Yeah. Is that a ladder? Yeah. Just make sure. Tell me if Shana's turned over. Yeah, well, what, she's in the yeah. ocean. Okay. So, in that challenge, Shani did not want to communicate me that she was going to drop that. Oh, did she drop it? She oh. dropped it. Not me. Not really pissed off. I really oh. tried. Really oh, obviously you did. Oh my god, don't be upset with yourself. You, you did amazing. No, we know you tried your hardest. We're all we proud of you. Oh my god, I just... Look, don't, you know, she you, made oh, that decision well, for me and oh. it just really upset me because Paige seems to think that Shani dropped the box first. To be honest, in my eyes, it doesn't really matter who dropped the box. The box dropped, we're going to tribal council. Let's figure it out. So, again, we just need to be better, aren't we? We're a bit yeah. split on someone else. Yeah, no, Did we just do what we actually do? Last tribal council was a pretty clear cut vote between Ben and Jerry, and things didn't go to plan. Jerry was sent to the other tribe. Yeah, so we're voting Ben. We're yeah. voting Ben. Yeah, we're voting Ben. We're voting Ben. Yeah. Benji's unpredictable, man. He's, he's a bit shifty. He kind of. Makes me feel a little nervous. And he knows that he's on the bottom. He knows that he's on the outs. He's definitely searching for an idol at the very least. He would do whatever it takes to survive in this game. Get Jerry over. Hey, Jerry, 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 Jerry. 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 Yeah. 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 So we're riding on his own. Yeah, OK. Yeah. Um, that gives me another day. Yeah, 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 mate. Oh, oh, mate. We're 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 there. There. I thought I was having hamburgers and having a big one. I know, we're voting Ben. I feel like Jerry knows well enough that he's certainly not at the top because he's voiced this hierarchy in the Heroes tribe. Right now, he needs to be working with the majority. We we just, just we just do benches. Yeah. It's important that we all stay strong. You know where I stand? Yep. Yeah. That's the way it is. 
Shining is very loyal. She likes to play with trust, and she's got a great relationship with Jerry. So we can't tell her. If, if Benji has an idol, Jerry will be collateral damage, unfortunately. So we were thinking we should play with the other half. Jerry? The rest of the Yeah. We're going to do four. Um, Jerry? Sure. We've had well, two. All the girls? The four of us. Yeah. Yeah. Girls, yeah. Jerry. Yeah. There should be six on Ben, yeah. five on Jerry. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Done. Done. We've hit a very good point in the group collective decision. I think the biggest goal right now is to make sure that Ben and Jerry feel cool, calm, and collected. You don't want them having any alarm bells ringing this close to Tribal Council. that I'm up next. It's either me or Jerry. But what my tribe doesn't know is that I've got a weapon in my pocket. This morning, I found some sort of clue. I'm back into ferret mode. Because time is running out that leads me to something like a hidden immunity idol. I might have a longer chance of this game. Ben, you've been up there for a bit, I know what he's doing. Ben, you've been up there for a bit, I know what he's doing. Congratulations, you found yourself in the community idol. I'm just out looking for coconuts, and I do notice through the bushes Ben at the well reading something. Yeah. Well, he had something. Could see him reading something. I don't know whether he saw me. Yeah, it'd be an idol. I'm confident that Ben has an idol. Nothing has changed. This information solidifies our plans that we need to flush Ben's idol or send him home with it. I was sure he looked like he was reading something. Like Next to it, like yeah, a like a clue or a thing. Either he doesn't get wind of it and he yeah. gets voted out with an idol, yeah. or he plays it, but then Jerry goes. Yeah. Ben's got an idol. 100% Ben has an idol. Well, then, yeah, then it'll be Jerry then. Exactly. Hopefully, Jerry will be safe and Ben will be going home. I think we've got a solid plan, but you never know what's going to happen at Tribal. Thank you. 
there's any plan at all? I was told that the boys want to go Benji. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So, yeah, that's so what I was told. told the four girls, you might not like them, but you know, you oh, yeah, the, four, four. the four girls are going to vote Jimmy, the boys are going to vote Ben. So that way, if he has an idol, he'll play it, it'll be flush. That's all I know. Okay. And we'll just go from there. Well, that's news to me. I didn't know the girls are voting for Jerry. The boys, they didn't mention a split. So he'll play an idol. I don't know. Right. If the plan is to flush Ben's idol, it leaves Jerry vulnerable. I don't want it to be Jerry. All I can do at this point is make sure that I go into tribe council tonight and stick up for the man. Because to me, he's the one true hero in this tribe. Finding an idol at this point of the game means so much. But what I'm worried about is that no matter how far I get, past swap, past merge, I'm still at the bottom rung. So this idol, I don't want to have to give it up immediately. I need some sort of scapegoat to divert attention away from me. Well, regardless. No, I'm super upset because I wasn't ready to give up. Just, just let it go. Weird. Yeah. I thought that's what it looked like. That's all poking up, folks. Oh, wow. Oh, thanks, Benji. Thanks, Mark. Thank you. You were amazing. Oh, I'm so proud for you, mate. That was an incredible effort. Thanks. Yeah, no, I just wanted to yeah, we're just gonna go have a little conversation with everyone that um, Shani actually threw that. Through no. That challenge. I wasn't the one who let go. Did you have a chat with her to confirm it? Or nope. you just she just done it, it on her own. My legs were there, and the next minute she'd pulled mine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Paige, she's an emotional player. Personally, I don't think anyone's to blame for today's loss. At the same time, hmm, I might be able to use that. I'm feeling very confident about tonight's tribal. I feel like this is the best time to send Benji packing with an idol in his pocket. Otherwise, it'll be Jerry tonight, man. It's as simple as that. Let's go. Let's get it done. I'm a storyteller by trade. I tell people what they want to believe. I want the narrative to shift. And when we've got our backs against the wall, we have to do morally ambiguous things in order to survive. And I can be a villain if I need to be. Watch heroes and villains collide in the ultimate battle for survival with full episodes over on 10 Play. Yeah. Wow, massive effort today. You lasted almost an hour and 10 minutes before you dropped. Yeah. How do you feel? Yeah, I'm a bit sore, a bit fatigued, you know, a bit, a bit down that, you know, uh, we didn't win, but I guess can't win everything. So, Shani, even though Paige dropped, she left nothing on the field. No, 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 no. No, no, I didn't drop. I didn't drop that box. Oh. No, no. I, my legs were there. Okay, so I, I, I misread that. 
So you're saying that Shawnee dropped it today? I've done quieter. I'm not saying that either, but I know my legs were where they were, and I felt pretty confident that I hadn't dropped the box. Shani, there's only two of you working together. <laughs> Correct. Yeah. If Paige didn't drop, then it must have been you. Apparently. Um, first I've heard of it. I don't give a I'm saying what I want to say. I uh, don't think it was me that dropped the box. I was very comfortable and ready and willing to continue. Shani, are you feeling a bit gaslit on this one? Yeah, I'm, I'm just having a moment to digest the fact that we're not celebrating the hour and 10 minutes between us. Um, I didn't realise that we were going to come in here and start blaming somebody for having dropped the box at all. I'm, I'm not blaming you. I'm just answered Jonathan's question. I am going to throw a spanner in the works. We have come here as a unified tribe tonight with the understanding that the vote was going to be unanimous. But several conversations this afternoon raised my antenna. A very trusted core member of the group thought that the challenge was thrown. So, Flick, are you aware of the conversations that Ben is talking about that he had this afternoon? No, I'm not really privy to those conversations. turned very quickly. They do every day, you know. Um, there's a lot of this going on that I'm not a part of. So you're okay. kissing an idol on yourself. OK. So fun. Well, Shani, let me ask you, did you have a say in tonight's vote? No. Moving forward, uh, it becomes a little bit more dog-eat-dog, -dog, like out for individual survival. Are you happy with the person who's going home tonight? No. I don't know who's going home tonight, but out of the names that were suggested to me that could be going home tonight, uh, I'm deeply disappointed. Jerry, how worried are you now? Uh, probably as worried as what I have been before. Historically speaking, my track record here with the heroes at um, Trilog Council is a little bit to be decided. For me, since day one, I've trusted Jerry. I've been very honest with the group that I won't write Jerry's name down because I believe in honesty and transparency. I think where we lacked that at the last Tribal Council was um, all this whispering stuff. Jerry did his mission as asked, and he wasn't really asked, as forced. Um, and I don't know if he's necessarily been given the, the credit that, that he really rightfully deserves. I have tried my hardest my entire life to be honest with people, not to lie to people. Um, coming into this, it's very clear that people are willing to do that to you. You know, loyalty only lives where it lives. You can only give loyalty back where loyalty is due. Loyalty is earned. Loyalty is reciprocated. But loyalty has to also be the end of naivety. 
And right now, we've had a dream run as a tribe. But we're about to enter a viper's nest. And we need to take the blinkers off and the rose-coloured glasses off and make some difficult decisions for the benefit for the entire team. And right now, I want to play with some hardened players. I want people going into the next phase, knowing what's required of them, so we can be survivors on the other end of it. Sean, that's a great pitch. He talks very well, doesn't he? He talks very well. <laughs> he does. Apparently, I've got a silver tongue. <laughs> He's got a way with words. <laughs> it is time to vote. It is time to vote. Ben, you're up. stick with the plan. I hope you did not play the idol that we think you have. I'll go count the votes. If anyone has a hidden immunity idol and you'd like to play it, now be the time to do so. Playing this for yourself? I am. Right, okay. This is a hidden immunity idol, and any votes cast for Ben will not count. I'll read the votes. First vote, Ben does not count. 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 Shani. One vote, Shani. Shani. That's two votes, Shani. Seventh person voted out of Heroes versus Villains. Shani. That's three votes. That's enough. Need to bring me a torch.
Shani, the tribe has spoken. Yeah. Time for you to go. Sai Shan. Well, if sticking up for your mates is the most heroic thing you can do, maybe the biggest hero just went home. <laughs>